एवरी वन वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल सो एज आई सेट इन माई मैसेज वीडियो टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू ड्रॉ द ब्लैक आई गैलेक्सी एज यू कैन सी आई स्केच इट आउट बिफोर बिकॉज आई कैन नॉट एट द सेम टाइम लुक एट द फोन एंड ड्रॉ दिस एंड इवन रिकॉर्डेड आई कैन नॉट डू दैट टूगेदर सो आई स्केच इट आउट बिफोर and now i'm showing you how it uh, looks now and now let's start coloring see first i'm going to use white <clears throat> this is a small broken piece but it's fine oh no i forgot let's lighten up the sketch a bit now it looks good so i am taking white and applying it on the center brown normal brown now you can see why i applied applied white because uh, yes the brown color would a bit smoother and, and give it a more natural more uh, kind of look more natural look now the color i am using is uh, dark brown now we don't have to blend it at the same time because the black eye galaxy looks pretty rough kind of looking ha now um, we're not blending it so it won't uh, look so artificial for look, making it look really natural we need to give it a, like this rough kind of look so that is why we are not blending it like this rest of the part as you know in the name of the galaxy mostly it would be black but first i am going to make a layer of this dark brown so on top if i add black so it doesn't look completely black it looks uh, a brownish black color okay that looks good now meet you when this is over okay so this is done now i'm taking violet as you can see here it's violet and uh, near the center i'm going to apply it a bit so it gives a kind of velocity i don't think it's called velocity sorry it gives kind of uh, the shade okay so it gives kind of the look a bit bluish purplish look that uh, we can see a bit in the center now i'm using black Yes, it looks very good. This galaxy is really beautiful. It's another name, uh, like uh, in the Messier type name, is 
Messier 64 and it is also called the Sleeping Beauty Galaxy. And it's imbued with really nice and beautiful stars. In the picture I saw in the Google, there was uh, red stars, green stars, like in... Yes, uh, I haven't seen like uh, those pictures in the pictures of stars precisely in any other galaxy. So, yes, I think this galaxy is very special. And it looks very special. Now I'm taking white and going over it to kind of blend it. There. Now I'm using dark violet over here to give it a more that uh, dark kind of shade because it looks uh, all black mm, looks good i think i should use a correction pen also to uh, make its score over here let's press oh no it's not coming out It isn't coming out. Uh, so I wasn't able to make the core white. The whitener is really stubborn. And uh, since I cannot make it white, so I just made it dark. Like uh, black. Now, uh, I think I shall darken it with uh, Persian blue. A bluish kind of look is also in the picture. And now, at the corners, there uh, it should look like very dark, very, 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 very dark see it's almost looking like the black eye galaxy we just need a couple of uh, more effects Okay, so these are the stars. Maybe uh, that is why the galaxy was looking so like a cloud. I don't know about that, but I sure know it is very beautiful and we are going to make it. Now for those red and nice dim stars. This is primary red. Let's see if we can make some. There, there, there. And some dark green also would be nice. It gives it own look. See how beautiful it looks now. I'm using both the browns to make a, a kind of outer light. That is coming from the galaxy. Let me tell you a fact. Now, if a space object is 
like uh, 10 light years away so the light that is reaching from it to us is 10 uh, what did I say 10 light years yes 10 years old light and when you see the object the object whatever it is the deep sky object or uh, a nice solar system object it is that years old image you are seeing isn't it fascinating you are seeing the past in the present like uh, take uh, for example the sun light takes 8 I don't know exactly yeah 8 and a half minutes to reach earth So the light we are seeing now is eight and a half minutes in the past. We are seeing the sun in the past, how it was before um, eight and a half minutes. Hey, it looks like the black eye galaxy. Mm, but not yet. Something is just missing so much. not the cold it shouldn't be colorful it should be white pure white there we go much nicer but i don't know where uh, how to make that white thing making the core is turned out as difficult is very difficult it's turned out so difficult now i don't think we have an uh, option instead of using white watercolor let's see how it works or it doesn't even oh no it's very messy some more water good It looks but it, it is not standing out it isn't let's at least spread it over the light parts looks like the black eye galaxy very much Almost looks like the picture I saw. Just the light that is coming from it is kind of so bluish. So I think I will. Oh, it's blue. But I have to use blue for the sky. So let's just uh, use the blue and then we will lighten it up with white. Yes, when this is done, I'm going to show you. Okay, so, so far it looks like this. Now, let's blend it. Let's see if a bit of magic can help us. Okay, so the blending is done and it looks great. See, it totally looks like the black eye galaxy. Yes, doesn't it? And now the thing we have to do is take white and then make some uh, area of that part light so because the black eye galaxy is black in color but it does have light right so how will we show its light by uh, by just um, lighting up the area a bit near it yes See, it looks so light up now. <laughs> okay, so this looks great. And now what we are going to do is, yes, add stars as usual. So, let us do it by magic again. Oops. Yes. 
Okay, so this is done. Thanks everybody for watching this video. Please like this video, share it with your friends and family, subscribe my channel and press the notification bell so you can watch more videos like this and be notified as soon as I post a video, a new video. You've reached the end of the video. Thanks for watching. Bye. Take care.